Hello everyone, I hope you're all good. Thank you for clicking on this video. I personally love watching these videos because I'm nosy. I just really enjoy seeing what people got for Christmas. This year, there actually wasn't like a main thing that I wanted. There was like a few little bits and bobs that I wanted this year. So yeah, we're gonna dig in and I'm gonna share with you guys what I got for Christmas 2020. I guess I'm just gonna pick things up at a random. So let's start with candles. My what I got for Christmas videos are not complete without Yankee candles. I think these have been in every single what I got for Christmas video. So this one here is the Christmas cookie. It smells absolutely gorgeous. This is probably my favorite Yankee candle that they do because I find the scent of this one is really quite nice and strong. So I smell it around the place. Whereas some of their candles, I don't smell it as much, but this one is really nice and strong. So Sean got me this one. My sister got me this Yankee candle, which is in cherry blossom. I've never had this scent before. So I'm not too sure how it's gonna burn, but it did smell really nice and quite sweet. So um, yeah, I'm excited to give that a go. Sean my sister Kayla got me this little candle here which actually has a bee on it. I will zoom in so you guys can see what it says. It says live well, be well and it's a scented candle. This has a little wooden top and it's quite a lemony fresh sort of scent but I just really liked it obviously because it had a bee on it. Sean's sister also got me this mini Himalayan salt lamp. My mum used to have a salt lamp in the hallway um, so I've not actually seen one this small. Like I didn't even know that they could come this small. Oh okay so that's the little bit there and then I put the batteries on and pop it like this. I'll probably put this near my other crystals because um, I have quite a decent collection now if I do say so myself. Yes, I am one of them girls that like crystals. <laughs> So Sean's sister also got us these bottles. Now these are what I asked for. The candle and the little Himalayan lamp were just like something extra she got me, but she actually got us these. So I wanted personalized bottles for the bathroom so that everything matches in there because sometimes I'd look at it and there'd be all these mixture bottles and I'm just like, oh, that is really not like satisfying me to see that. So I picked the color and the font that I wanted them to go with. So we've got shampoo, conditioner, shower gel, bubble bath. I proper feel like Miss Hinge <laughs> with this. Like, you know, she's got all like her name bottles and stuff. Like, I feel like her. So yeah, I just think these are really, really lovely. And I'll give you a little close up shot so you can just see how the writing looks as well. I'm gonna share with you what my mum actually got me because I had these presents fairly early because basically she gave me money and I just went and bought bits and bobs that I could open and have for Christmas day. So the first thing I picked up from my mum for myself was from the white company and I love their fireside scent that they come out with I think it was this year and last year I've never had a white company candle before this little set here is the pomegranate one and inside I get a candle home spray and mini diffuser this was 32 pounds because I still left the tag on it when I looked at reviews online, the pomegranate scent had really good reviews. Pomegranate, seashells, and winter, I think it was, had really good reviews. You get the mini candle, mini room spray, and then the mini diffuser. And I just thought this is a really nice little collection to try this scent out with. And then actually, while we're talking about White Company, these aren't actually in the box, but our lovely neighbors got us um, the White Company hand wash and hand cream in the scent pomegranate. And I was like, that is so bizarre because obviously um, that was the scent that I wanted to try this year. But yeah, how sweet is that? Next thing from my mum is from Zara. Now I won't do a cutaway scene of me wearing this just because I'm gonna actually take a photo for my Instagram of me wearing this. Basically, I saw this sort of lounge tracksuit vibe. So it's this nude top here but it's cropped in as you can see there and I like my crop tops to be a little bit more fitted underneath the booby area. Then they had the joggers to match and I was like oh I love them because they had pockets on the joggers and I love that it gives it a little bit of like a combat sort of style and yes yeah, so these are the joggers as well. They are cuffed at the bottom. The top was 10 and the bottoms were 18 and I love this nude color. I was meant to be getting customized Air Forces from Sean for Christmas and basically we sent the lady the trainers and she's gonna customize them with like a nude color on them. I cannot wait to have them. They unfortunately haven't been done yet because by accident she painted a wrong part of the design and when she tried to paint over it, the white just didn't look like the rest of the white. So yeah, she said the only way that she can obviously redo these is until after Christmas now. So unfortunately I'm having to wait for them. Um, but in the same sense, I'd much rather wait and have shoes that I'm genuinely really happy with and happy with the results 
rather than just taking them for the sake of getting them now. Yeah, so we're having to wait for those to be done again. And they were like one of my main sort of presents off of Sean was the customized Air Forces. And they still will come. And when I get them, I'll take a photo in them with the Zara tracksuit that my mum got me. And I'll post it on Instagram. My Instagram's here. Feel free to follow, feel free to follow. As I just show clothes, I'll do these as well. Sean got me this top that I really wanted from Sisters and Seekers. Oh, I just love that. Look at the Dobermans on there. The Dobermans look a little bit distorted as well. I know how much this top was. This was 26 99 And I just think this with my really nice leggings, my Dot Martins, a huge puffer jacket, a cap, or, you know, just like my beanie hat, just for casual wear. I just love that. Like, I just... I really, really like that. I'm really, really happy with this. Then Sean's brother and sister's dad got me these leggings from Primark. These are workout leggings. These have a slight ombre and these are from Primark. And because these were bought relatively close to Christmas, I'm guessing that you can get them in store now. I haven't tried them on, so I don't know if they are squat proof just yet. But when I put my hand through them and stretch it out, you can't see anything. We have the little top, which just looks like this. And then he also got me some fluffy socks from Primark. These are my absolute favorite. I love wearing these in winter. And then Sean actually got me some fluffy socks, which have a little bit of a grip on the bottom of them for when I wear them around the house, because Lord knows I slip and fall all the damn time. <laughs> Sean also got me some Calvin Klein's. I knew that I was getting Calvin Klein's because when the box arrived, it had it written all over it, like my Calvin's. And I said to him, who are they for? And he was like, oh, nobody. And I was like, well, they're for me then, because you just said they're for nobody, which... You've just baited yourself up and that's for me now. <laughs> and he's like, leave me breathe, like stop asking me questions. And I was like, well, you just gave it away. But anyways, I got some uh, black Calvin Klein thongs, gray ones. And then we got a little hot pink moment. Giddy. So my sister actually got me these Winnie the Pooh and Piglet pajamas. These are from Primark. The bottoms are actually in the other room because on Boxing Day I had a shower and then I just changed into these. I'll zoom in so you can see that. And they're quite nice and fleecy. So she also got me some shower gels from Molten Brown. One of my dad's favorite shower gels is from here. I think it's Black Pepper, and we normally get him like that or the aftershave. In the little bag, there are three Molten Brown mini shower gels. This one is relaxing, ylang ylang. Ylang ylang, hello. No? Anyone? Anyone? Okay, it's a quiet room. Um, <laughs> and then she got me orange and bergamot. Bergamot? Probably absolutely butchering that. And then she got me delicious rhubarb and rose. I love a bit of rhubarb, that smells so nice. So yeah, she got me, she got me, fuck. So I got those from my sister and her family. I'm gonna try and show you the present that Sean's mum and her husband got us. Uh, it's really big and quite a funny one to try and fit in a video actually, but it's a fake tree. <laughs> it looks like this. And like that, our one died and we decided we want a fake one. So we just said to her, can we get this one? Um, so that way we don't have to actually try and look after it. So uh, yeah, we got a fake tree. <laughs> then his mum and her husband also got us a light shade that we wanted. So these light shades, I already have two in my front room. And I just wanted to have the exact same one in my bedroom. I just wanted it to match. It's still in this wrapper right now, but it has gray in the middle and then it has this geometric silver going around it and it just sits like this sticking with the whole adult sort of theme my gorgeous friend mark actually got me and sean these knives which you can't see but they're a black set of um six piece black knife set with matching blade protective things he got um, us these and then i'll show you what else he got us he also got us this 16 jar spice rack and my spices and herbs and like this actually getting a little bit full in the cupboard so we're definitely going to put that up and it's silver so it will go nicely with the kitchen for those of you who don't know this year myself and sean lost our fur baby Monica, she was 16 years old. You know, she meant so much to us guys. I, I don't actually want to talk about it too much because it's still, even up to this day, it gets me a little bit emotional. So he got me this little necklace here which has her paw print engraved on it and then underneath it says Monica. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a close up so you can see exactly what it looks like. I'm gonna change the chain though because I just think this chain might be a little bit too thick for me, um, but we'll see. So this was super sweet and a really sentimental gift. Okay, I'm gonna carry on with what Sean got me as well. And then the next thing, <laughs> which is really random and I did not expect this, but it was a laptop tray. 
and yesterday I used it for the first time to have McDonald's on. <laughs> it's meant for um, work, but you know, I thought, well, I'm on the sofa and I've got a tray now, so I'm gonna use it to eat the food on as well. Sean also got me a perfume. This is Black Opium. I have had this before. Really like this, had this before. It's kind of like a nice sweet scent, if I remember correctly. Um, but yeah, so he got me that. He also got me a new face for my Apple Watch and a new strap. So last year I got a magnetic strap, I think. I don't know if it was last year, the year before, I don't know, I can't really remember. But anyway, he got me a silver one, but my Apple Watch is actually rose gold. So because I didn't have a face to cover it, I just gave the strap to my sister. I said, I do actually want one, but I want a silver face covering for it as well. So now I can actually wear this and make it look a little bit more smarter. Or when I wanna like layer my jewelry and stuff, I can still wear my Apple Watch. Then this year I have actually gone a little bit like Nintendo switch crazy so for Christmas Sean got me free games this one I've been playing since Christmas Day and I am addicted addicted Splatoon 2 is so good you roll around and you have to paint their turf they get away you have to hit them out the way you have to like slide through it if you get stuck in the ink oh my gosh I I'm just so pleased with this year like I really am obsessed if you have a Nintendo Switch and you're looking for a new game to get, please check out Splatoons 2. Love it. Then from Sean, I also got the Harry Potter double collection and I won't even act like I don't love Harry Potter. I flipping love Harry Potter, like I'm obsessed. And this just made me laugh because this is like, you know, the inner child in me is like getting Harry Potter. So I got that one. I haven't played that one yet because that's still in the seal. And then he also got me a Zumba. So I do like dance workouts sometimes from home and I'll do like hip workouts, kickboxing, um, Zumba. Like I do a whole bunch of like at home workouts really. He just thought he'll get this so I can give it a go, see if I like it. And then last thing for the Switch, he got to me a travel case. I need to buy a extra SD card for memory and I'm also gonna get the port charger but I'm gonna get that out of the money my dad got me for Christmas or gave me and um, yeah so I have a carry case now for my switch I feel like a big child even holding this but the switch is my life right now like it's my life for some of you guys this might be your first time watching me but if you are familiar with my YouTube videos you're gonna laugh when you see this okay are you ready <sighs> look how many there is Oh my god, I just want to eat them all now. <gasps> Get in my belly. I eat about 12 of these a day. I have tried to cut back a little bit to like six, as I said like ages ago. But um, I'm making my way down now, like slowly but surely. And I have a whole flipping box of them. Speaking of chocolate and stuff like this, Sean's brother got me this really cute little mug and I'm trying to hold it because I ripped the top of it and it's got this little mini whisk so you get the hot chocolate and you get these little pot of marshmallows you know what let me just take that off for now and then this is what the cup itself looks like so you've got little pink dots and stuff this next present was the only thing I asked Sean's brother for this year and this is this real crystal pop socket so I just zoomed in so you can see it's got this sort of gold plated trimming around the side and then you've obviously got the crystal here and then you've got the pop socket. So I bought myself a plain black case to stick this on because how nice is that gonna look on a case though? Now I'm gonna quickly run through some stocking, random bits and bobs. Sean got me these glasses case. It says Sabrina's glasses. I actually own three pairs of prescription glasses and I always lose them. Yes I do. <laughs> I also have a doggy coloring book, which looks like this. Dogs are amazing, they are real life angels. My dad and his wife gave me money this year that I'm gonna use towards getting my SD card for my Switch so I can have like more games on there. And then every year now they've made it a tradition because they can't let me down with this. They have to get me the hot chocolate bombs. Have you guys ever tried these? They are the chocolate bombs that you put into your, your, your cup. Can I talk? What the hell is wrong with me? And then you use your hot milk and you melt it and there's marshmallows inside. And Then I got the spoon one that you can use. And then they got me some Frere Rochers. And then my brother and his girlfriend just got me a little smelly dove set. I hope I've managed to show everything because sometimes when I do these videos, I'll go into another room or I'll find something and be like, oh my God, that was a present. But yeah, I think this is everything now. Um, as I mentioned, I've got Christmas money that I'm going to spend. And um, I'm waiting for two more presents to arrive from Sean. One being the customised Air Forces. The other present that I'm waiting for him, which is coming from America, um, is pretty bougie. So I'm going to share that on my Instagram stories. You guys will see that 
on there so make sure you follow me on there and yeah that is absolutely everything i hope you have enjoyed this video i'm going to put this up a little bit earlier than wednesday just because i normally try to upload now on wednesdays and sundays but i want to get this up a little bit earlier for you guys just because um, I want to be closer to Christmas. With us approaching 2021, if there are any videos that you guys want me to do, I have a little list and I'm working my way through that list. Comment them down below. I read every single comment and I try to reply to every single comment as well. So um, yeah, comment down below any video requests that you have and I'll add them to my list. Okay, that's it all. I'm gonna love and leave you now. Stay blessed, stay safe, stay positive, all those good vibes and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.